What's up Geeksters, it's me Omar from GeeksterLabs.com and today's video is brought to you by Cell Cashier and they compare iPhone prices to get you top dollar for your used iPhone so if you'd like to sell your iPhone check out the link in the description below. So the product that I'm going to be showing you guys today is something that was sent to me free for review from Ecobee. And today we have the Ecobee 3 which is basically a smart Wi-Fi thermostat with remote sensor. So this product retails for about $250. Now usually when most people think of smart thermostats they think of Nest but actually Ecobee was the first company to sell a Wi-Fi connected thermostat and with their current iteration the Ecobee 3 it blows Nest and other smart thermostats completely out of the water. So let's talk about it. First off, it's super easy to install and it only takes about 20 minutes or so to get it up and running and everything you need is included in the box. One of the special pieces that's also included with the Ecobee 3 that really makes it stand out from other thermostats, including Nest, is the remote sensor. Now with the basic kit, one is included in the box, but you can purchase additional two packs for 80 bucks a piece and you can add up to 32 sensors if you're living in a mansion. Each sensor runs off of a coin cell battery and lasts up to four years on average. They're very small, they're very lightweight, and they each include a little stand, a double-sided tape, and a wall mount in case you want to put it on your wall. Now each of these sensors measures temperature and movement. Now most thermostats, they measure temperature in one area of the house, usually the hallway where it's located. But if you have a larger home, like a two-story, you know that some areas of, of your home are going to be hotter or colder than that hallway. So that's where these sensors come into play. And keep in mind that the Ecobee panel also includes a motion and temperature sensor as well. So the way it works is like this. The Ecobee takes an average of all the sensors that it detects occupancy. So let's say at night when everybody is upstairs, the Ecobee will only use the temperature readings from those sensors upstairs to decide when to turn on the AC or the heater. They can also tell when you're not at home so that the thermostat will go into away mode and change the temperature so that it doesn't have to kick on as often and waste energy and money. So let's check out the options and settings that are shown on the panel. One cool feature is that it recognizes when you approach it and it kind of wakes up when you get close to it. The first thing you'll see is the current indoor temperature of the house and the temperature settings for cold and heat, which you can adjust on the fly to temporarily hold them. Above the temperature is the system mode and below that is the indoor humidity. On the bottom we have the menu, we have a button for live weather so you can see the weather in your area if it's hooked up to the Wi-Fi. And the next option is the quick change option which is good for telling the Ecobee when you're about to leave the house so it can get ready to go into away mode. So under menu, some of the cool things you're able to see are like under sensors. You can check and see what the temperatures are for each of them throughout the house and you can control the option for each sensor as well. Under schedule you can set specific times that you want the thermostat to run the comfort settings is where you set the temperature you want the Ecobee to use when you're at home, when you're away, or, or during sleeping hours. You can also set vacation hours and reminders and alerts as well. So that's pretty much it for the thermostat, and the best part about learning how the thermostat works is that the app on the phone is exactly the same. So you don't need to learn a whole new interface just to control it from your phone. Now for the iPhone, the app works in conjunction with HomeKit, and it's super simple to check on the temperature or settings of the house while you're away, or when you're just being lazy and don't want to come downstairs to read the thermostat. I've been using this thermostat for a little over a month now and I have zero complaints. It works exactly how it's meant to and it's definitely helped us keep our energy usage down and save this money. If you're in the market for a smart thermostat, the Ecobee 3 is where it's at and you can find it almost anywhere. I'll include a link in the description if you're interested in purchasing it on Amazon. So that's it for me today, guys. Let me know if you have any questions about this product, and I'll do my best to get back to you as quick as possible. I just want to give one more shout-out to our sponsor of this video, CellCashier.com. If you're looking to get cash for your used iPhone, it's very easy, fast, and secure. You just go to their site, you get a quote, you ship your phone, and then you get paid. It's that simple. I hope you enjoyed this review. If so, please show some love to the like button down below and share this video with your friends as well. If you want to stay up to date with all of my videos on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video review.